these four 330 watt panels are coming off the rack today and they're going up for sale they're six months old the only reason i'm selling them is because i'm going with a bigger panel and i've extended my rails here's the specs hopefully it focuses there you go Pop. And there you have it the new array is installed i just got to wire it up that's 2180 watts i have the old panels were 1320 and these are the split ones so if you have snow or shade on one half the other half still produces they're 540 watts each get the calculator out you'll see what that is you'll still be producing over 200 watts with a little bit of snow sitting on the bottom here just gonna wire these up i might have to make some wires because it's all different my old ones used to be up here where the diode box was that's interesting so i better not muck with it so i'm gonna get this hooked up just temporary for tonight and i'll wire it up properly tomorrow 1300 watts and it's cloudy out and it's 10.40 a.m. I'm impressed with this new array, 545-watt panels. Full cloud. The sun is behind the clouds. And I'm peaking at 1,400 watts already. I won't get to test it at solar noon clear day because it's not going to happen today for those asking about stacking you can stack the uh, Delta Pro is in the middle the two EB's top and bottom and I put my freezer beside it because it is a little wobbly I sort of leaned it towards the fridge I have this freezer, it's a 3.1 cubic foot, plugged in. I have this fridge plugged in. I've had the fridge plugged in since October. This under cabinet light is on there. Uh, what else have I got? The PC tower's on there, the TV's on there, the weather station's on there. The Marantz stereo receiver's on there. My DVR for recording TVs on there. There's a Wi-Fi thing for the weather station and a eight port switch back there. And there's a cord going through the wall feeding my security camera with three cameras on the house. It's pulling about six kilowatt hours a day. Since I plugged that in 75, I'm gonna reset that and do a 24 hour on that and see what I'm pulling. Last time I checked, it was 5.1 per day, but I added the deep freeze. Well, it's not a deep freeze. It's an upright freezer since. So actually, I want to test just the freezer. I'll reset that and run that for 24 hours, see what it pulls. <laughs> 